Was eating your food? <laughs> so welcome back and welcome to Boxing Day at Centre Parks. Oh, we had a very relaxed morning here. It is our last day, however, so feeling that kind of like, oh, we're going home tomorrow. It's okay. We've already got other centre parks trips to look forward to in the not too distant future. And right now, we are about to head out. We've had a very chilled morning. It is now time for the pancake house. It is. Because, you know, we haven't eaten enough this trip. For the first time ever, I don't actually feel excited about going because like, I'm full. I'm sure once the food we'll comes spot. out or I see the menu, I will, yeah, probably change. Yeah. And of course, we can't leave Woburn without another little whiz around the rapids later as well. So, quite a bit to do really. So, let's get going. Salad, don't they? I don't know, I might be having a look though. <laughs> oh, hang on, I'm a little bit more hungry now. Nachos. I knew, I knew it. I was like, <laughs> as soon as you see the nachos, you'll be like, hmm. I've forgotten all about those, yeah. <laughs> I've got some nutrition, look. Oh, yes. I've got some cherries on mine. You can't see them because I know I have a chocolate sauce. So. <laughs> <laughs> and look, we've got some tomato and some avocado. You're going to mug someone. Yeah. <laughs> I thought it could be an extra layer of water that's in my jacket on. <laughs> I've got an extra layer of warmth. Right here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so this is what you've been doing you come up here with Harper. Building dens. So Titanic rituals. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Take a seat, get comfortable, 
and listen to our winter wonderland tale. It was not Meg the Reindeer's first Christmas at Centre Parks. He had come all the way from Lapland with his mother and father to meet the guests at Winter Wonderland. And there we have it, that was our last time at the swimming and rapids for this break. The rapids were very popular, so there was a constant fear of like turning a corner and finding some small child there ready to be squashed, but thankfully that was okay. And I found you with your legs wrapped around another man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he enjoyed it. Now it's Boxing Day, which can only mean one thing for dinner. A picky tea. Love a picky tea. Who doesn't love a picky tea? However, we uh, we planned after swimming to go down to the park market to go and get a few bits and found they were closed. Obviously we completely failed to kind of think about the fact it's a bank holiday and they obviously aren't on their normal hours. So that means no picky tea for us tonight. But instead we decided to give the restaurant runner an option. Now the restaurant runner option is on this cube, which was in the room, or in the lodge, somewhere. Oh, on the bottom, of course. Mm -hmm. And it says, from Italian to Indian or American to East Asian, we deliver your favorite restaurant dishes right to your lodge. Can't decide, you can mix and max between all four menus for just one delivery charge. And the delivery charge was 3.95. Now, we've actually both decided we wanted burgers and chips from Huck's. So we are just waiting on that being delivered now. It's due to be here in about 10 minutes. Well, I can see somebody pulling up, so maybe it's here early. This is a sort of unboxing you can expect on this channel. Bit of coleslaw for the health. Okay, it's now the following day, as you can tell, because hopefully we feel a little bit fresher than we did last night. I'm not sure I do mm. actually. Do no. that. <laughs> um, so, yeah, last night we just completely crashed out, and it's now the day for us to go home. As you can see, we have been un untidying. No, tidying. So last night, restaurant runner. In all honesty, like the food was tasty. It was a bit cold when it got to us and there was a slight error with one of the um, things that we'd ordered. But phoned them up and they were very quick to be like, okay, we can send some more. And I was like, no, no, that's fine. Just like, we can sort it out. I would just go to the restaurant where I can in future. It's yes. only because last night we were kind of like forced into yeah. to going there that we, we ended up having to, to do it. So, yeah. yeah. Now there's already plenty of cars. Oh, well, there's somebody there, look. She doesn't realize she's famous now. <laughs> I'm sure she'll be thrilled. Yeah. So in very quick summary, Centre Parks at Christmas, is it worth it? It's a lot of money, isn't it? Yeah, but like it's also, like it wasn't massively different to August prices, so if you're used to paying that with a family, actually I don't think it's too bad. We're not, so... Yeah. <laughs> it, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so we, yeah, we would normally avoid the school holidays and the times that um, prices are higher because we don't need to come at those times. However, like the actual experience of being here has been amazing. But being here for Christmas and like Christmas Eve, Santa's parade, Christmas day going down the rapids, you know, even the time we spent in the lodge has just felt like festive and like nice. So I would say yes, it absolutely is worth it, if you can. I would agree, yeah. yeah. Which is just as well since we're, um, we're doing it next year. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine if we said no. <laughs> It's we'll right. you to come back soon. Exactly. <laughs> so we're now getting towards the end of this year. We have got uh, some vlogs to come very, very soon from our first ever cruise. We went around the Caribbean and that was a lot of fun, wasn't it? Yeah. So yeah. If, you, uh, if you're interested, then keep an eye out for those vlogs that will be starting very soon. Otherwise, don't worry, there are still plenty more centre parks planned. I think we've got three or four trips already booked in for next year um, at 
lots of different sites. So if you're only here for centre parks, that's quite all right. Please don't go anywhere. And uh, hopefully we'll be able to bring you some more centre parks content soon. I think that's it. Best go and get the car. Best get on our way. Four, four hours on water driving to get home. It's going to be busy. It's going to be busy. Got yeah. the washing. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've really enjoyed these videos. We've really enjoyed making them. And we will see you again soon. Bye. Bye.